hello guys welcome to how to fix stack in this video guys we are going to debloat the windows 11 in order to improve the system performance so we will start with only one command here so let's move to the windows 11 pc so this is the command to speed up the windows 11 performance and open the powershell as admin here run as administrator click on yes now you just need to paste this command here and hit enter now once you hit enter the another window will open up so you can first of all disable the Cortana and now you can see script will run let me enable this now Cortana has been enabled but we want to disable this Cortana has been disabled now the second thing you need to change here is uninstall OneDrive so let me show you the OneDrive here fwiz.cpl ok so I have already uninstalled that in a testing so you just need to click on this option uninstall OneDrive if you have but as you can see uninstalling it has already does not exist or there are no file found so I have already uninstalled the OneDrive so the second thing you need to do is it's going to ok OneDrive has been successfully uninstalled now disable telemetry tasks it means that your identity and other things Microsoft gets and sends to the gets it so you can disable those services like you can see here turning off data collection disabling location tracking disabling location tracking disabling people icon on taskbar disabling schedule task stopping and disabling web push services stopping and disabling diagnostic tracking and service telemetry service has been disabled so this is the second step now move on to the third step remove the bloatware registry just click this option and also tick this option unpin task from taskbar unpinging all tiles from the start so you need to wait here for some time now once it is done remove bloatware registry now blot blotware key has been removed successfully ok so here is the most important part here do not tick this option remove all blotware we need to customize this select this option customize block list so once we have selected that you need to scroll down and we have to untick three options here as you can see it is going to remove the Bing search Microsoft health and messaging key we don't need this Microsoft.news we need to only untick this option some options from here 3D print if it is you can untick this option one note we don't need Microsoft dot remote desktop and take this option as well Microsoft Windows alarm you 
you can see it is going to remove Candy Crush and third party apps as well Spotify, Facebook, Twitter we don't need at all advertising portal extensions framework we don't need this so make a note of which I'm going to untick from here this is very important since it is also going to remove the Microsoft Paint as well as the calculator so let me untick these options you can see here Microsoft Paint just untick this option win get this is a package installer Microsoft Windows Terminal Windows Store and take this option as well Photos Now we are good to go Save and this option Save Custom Allow List and block Lexus custom tick this option now you can close this out and click on this option remove blotware with custom block list now it's going to remove all the blotware now it may take some time as you can see it has been removed now and it has been successfully initiated this so we need to close this and close this also and just restart your system guys and thereafter you will see your system will be running faster so this is how you can debloat the Windows 11 to improve the Windows 11 performance on your Windows 10 or 11 both are same so hope this video useful for you guys if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech